New COVID variants are being closely watched this year. As medical reporter Liz Bonus explains, one is now making people sick in China as the other rapidly takes over here in the U.S. Hey there, everybody. Hello to you. The World Health Organization now says there are more than 500 new Omicron variants circulating worldwide. At least a couple have the potential to cause a new year COVID wave. The first is being called the next new thing to potentially cause a surge of breakthrough infections and reinfections of COVID-19. It's the Omicron subvariant XBB 1.5. The CDC now says it's responsible for more than 40% of new cases in the U.S. It can make especially the immune compromised seriously sick. It appears to be really good at evading our current immunity from vaccines or prior infection. Research shows it's also better at binding to our cells than some other variants, which means if you are exposed, it sticks. You know, a few weeks ago, um, I think we had more influenza patients in the hospital than COVID, and that has switched. Public health specialist Dr. Steve Fagan says most patients he sees now likely with XBB 1.5 in the hospital are there with something else. Heart attack, atrial fibrillation, some other, you know, medical illness. But not so, he says, about the other next new thing in COVID-19 variants. It's called BF7. This Omicron subvariant is reportedly responsible for the latest 2022 COVID-19 surge in China changing travel restrictions. That travelers from China uh, after January 6th uh, will need to show a, a negative test. And leaving all of us who are not up to date with vaccines highly vulnerable as immunity wanes. Now the top symptoms reported from the ZO COVID study linked to both of these variants include a sore throat, runny nose, sneezing, cough, headache, hoarse voice, and muscle aches and pains. The good news, the common altered taste and smell symptom, that is actually last on the list with these newer variants. I'm medical reporter Liz Bonus. Now back to you.